Hey friends, welcome back to the Makers Gonna Learn YouTube channel. We are back with you guys for another Timu video. Everybody on the internet is obsessed and we are gonna bring you guys all of our favorite shopping hacks and tips today that we have been using every time that we shop on Timu. If you're not familiar with Timu, we have a video that I will link below for you all and you can kind of get up to speed with things. But basically what it is, is a very cheap, shopping platform where you guys can find things like craft supplies, clothing, organizational items, and all of the above. So make sure to stay tuned and you guys are gonna learn all of our favorite shopping hacks whenever we shop on Timu. So Timu website is very, very full and busy. There's lots of different things for you all to browse through. Um, obviously we're on the home screen right now and like we can already see there's lots of random things like popping up. We've got shoe charms, a uh, Dyson hair wrap dupe. Um, so lots of random items. Uh, but you can see there's kind of a lot to look at and it can be a little bit overwhelming. So I like to kind of go into this website with a little bit of an idea of what I'm looking for. And a lot of times whenever, like if you wanted to look for craft supplies, you don't have to be super specific, but you can just go to the search bar and it's going to give you a variation of craft supplies. But you all are welcome to come over here and change the category, the color, different interests. You can even do the drop down menu, stuff like that. Um, but as you can see, there's lots of different options. So it can be overwhelming. Make sure that you all are utilizing your search bar as much as possible. And then also utilizing the filters within the search once you get there. And that way you're not going to be so overwhelmed when you're searching the website. One thing that we made the mistake of is not checking our measurements whenever we made a purchase. So I'm gonna click on this little paper cutter right here because we did purchase this paper cutter. So once you get onto your listing, if there's no description listed, you can always go over here to these images and it's gonna give you more detailed description of the size of the item. So you can see this one's 14 by three and a quarter. And you just wanna make sure that you are checking the size proportions of things before you purchase them. A lot of times these discount websites will be a little bit cheaper, which also means their items are a little bit smaller. Um, and also the sizing can be a little bit off, especially if you're purchasing clothes and things like that. Um, but when you're doing crafts, like we wanna kind of be precise. And so you wanna make sure that you are checking all of those size dimensions before you actually make your purchase. We ran into a lot of comments where people were like, yes, I purchased this, I purchased this. It actually works perfectly, but it's a little bit too small or it's just not the right size. So our second tip is just to check your measurements before you make that purchase. Something else that is really, really helpful when using websites like this is purchasing your blanks. That way you've got something to practice on while you're crafting rather than investing a lot of money into more expensive, higher quality items. You can purchase things like wooden rounds for signs or acrylic blanks, things like that for much cheaper. I mean, you all can see right here, there's a three piece wood round. These are almost 12 inch wood rounds. Like that's a pretty solid substantial size for a wood round for 748. So that is just incredibly cheap. Like if you all are purchasing wood rounds, um, or wood period, you know it's crazy expensive right now. So this is gonna be super, super helpful for those of you who wanna make samples. Maybe if you do craft shows and things like that, you're gonna be able to make these on a lower budget. And then you can actually sell higher quality wooden rounds. Obviously you can purchase those and make them separately, but this way they're gonna have something to look at, or you can actually use these just to test out different stains and paints and things like that. So. There's lots of options for blanks on the Timu website. You can see they even have sublimation blanks. We did test out some of their sublimation magnets and they did beautifully. So lots of options here for crafty blanks. I really, really love this section of Timu. I just feel like it's hard to find cheap blanks, especially when you're just learning. And so this is gonna be really helpful, especially for our beginners out there, or those of you that just like to save a little bit of money. 
So while we're on the subject of budget-friendly items, I want to talk to you all about the price fluctuations that you're going to encounter when you get onto Timu. So a lot of other times when you're shopping on other websites such as Walmart, um, I don't want to say Amazon because Amazon prices fluctuate a lot, but most of the time you're going to find that items are generally like in the same price range unless they're on some type of discount. But on Timu, the prices fluctuate a lot more often and items sell out a lot quicker. So make sure that you are snagging up your items as quickly as you can. If you see it, get it. Um, and don't try to revisit because the price may be a little bit different the second time around than it was the first time you saw it. So generally speaking, everything's going to be pretty cheap, but you want to go ahead and get it while you can because people are crazy about Timu right now and they're just snatching up all of those items that they really love. And so things are selling out a lot quicker, which in turn sometimes makes the price go up a little bit more. We even had someone comment that a price changed and they requested a price adjustment and received like $36 back. I don't know how that works. Like I don't know if they're receiving a store credit or something like that, um, but you know, it's worth a shot. The worst they can say is no. So make sure if you have questions, Timu does have a customer service that you can reach out to and you can talk to them there about price adjustments or you know, if you're having any other issues, I'm sure they're more than willing to help you all out. We've also been seeing lots of people, whenever they are not receiving their order, they're giving them like a $5 credit. So they receive their order, but not in the time frame that they were expected to. So say you were supposed to get on Tuesday, you got it on Thursday. Timu has been crediting $5 to their account so they can use it towards more products, which is really nice. And it shows that they really do pay attention. So I love and appreciate that. And we have also seen people requesting coupons when their orders are not delivered on time. So I don't know what they're exactly like sending them, but I know that they are honoring that time frame that they are saying that your order is going to be delivered. So if you do have issues with your order coming in on time, make sure to reach out to their customer service. And it sounds to me like they're more than willing to help everyone out. Okay, so now I want to talk to you all about the affiliate program. Now, a lot of times people become affiliates because they are influencers or they have a huge following on the internet, but Timu bases their branding and their marketing all around this affiliate program. So they make it very, very easy for you all to share a link. And in return, you're going to receive a $5 download reward per every person that downloads and logs in using your affiliate link. And you're also going to get up to 20% commission per new user order when they use that affiliate link as well. And I believe you can withdraw from PayPal after you spent like a certain amount of money. So the affiliate benefits are really, really good. Now, if you do have a larger following, obviously you're going to get a lot more bonuses and things like that. Um, but you know, if you're just sharing here and there, I think $5, you know, three or four of your friends sign up, you're already getting a little chunk of change there. And so this is really cool because they make it accessible for everyone. And we're going to drop a link below for you all. It's just going to be like the affiliate program link. You can click that. If you're not interested in this, we can put our affiliate link and you can shop through it and then we get a portion of the uh, benefits from your purchases and things like that. So that's pretty cool because I think that a lot of times these type of affiliate programs seem unreachable, but they really, really want to get the word out about Timu and they're doing a really good job. And I honestly think a lot of it is due to this affiliate program. You can see over here, we have our link. We can just copy this. And then whenever someone wants to go shop, they can just shop directly through that link. So pretty easy, cut and dry. Um, if you all have any questions or if you have anything that you'd like to say about this program, I'd love to hear your all's thoughts about this type of thing for Timu. I honestly think it's really smart. They probably don't have to pay for like little to zero marketing um, because, you know, people are doing it for them. They're showing their links and they're sharing it to people to get the word out. So it's pretty cool. Now, if you've went through all of these hacks and tips and you're like, okay, you know, I'm kind of over it. I've shopped, I've da 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 da, or you've shopped, but you're still getting notifications from Timu like via text or email, 
you can disable those. You can send stop directly to the text messages and they will just stop sending you texts altogether or you can unsubscribe from emails. So make sure to do that if you don't like receiving lots of emails and texts from random companies because they do send a lot of text messages. I have them set up on my phone and I had to cancel them even though I do like knowing what the latest deals and stuff are, I really just don't want to be getting those random marketing text messages all the time. So you can easily stop those by just sending the word stop in a text message or you can unsubscribe in the email. If you all like today's video, make sure to go onto our channel and watch our other Timu content. We have tons of creative crafty content as well as Timu content and we would love for you all to check it out. If you're not already subscribed, make sure to hit that subscribe button and the post bell notification. That way, every time we post a new video, you guys are the first ones to know. We'll see y'all in the next one.